Hey guys, and today you are about to learn how to play kickball. Do you like playing outdoors and enjoy the game of baseball, but don't have a bat and glove for all your friends? Here's a suggestion for something different. Try kickball. It's easy. All you need is a ball and some friends. Today you will learn about pitching, kicking, base running, and fielding. After reading these tips and a little bit of practice, you'll be a superstar. What you want to do is roll the ball softly towards the middle of the plate, like a bowling ball. The fielders are always going to throw the ball to you at the end of the plate. So stay alert. If you don't pay attention, the ball could hit you in the head, or runners could advance more bases. The point of kicking is to advance runners or start a rally if no one's on base. When the ball is kicked, make sure you run all the bases. I'm not going to do that. Make sure you don't overrun a base like this. That could cost us some serious outs. Also, don't try for an impossible home run. That could also cost you outs. Base running is probably the most important out of all of these steps. It goes, it goes a lot like kicking, but there's a twist. When the ball is kicked, make sure you keep your eye on the ball so you know whether to keep going or to head back to whatever base you're at. So if I ignored that step and just kept running, I was caught and he got me out. Now you have to pay attention to that a lot because you don't want you don't want your team getting three outs very fast. For example, it's very important that you keep your eye on the ball. Let's just say bases are loaded. The kicks. Oh, I think I think he drops it. I start running home. Yes. Oh no. I'm too late. The bases were loaded. I thought he dropped it. And I got out because of a force. And a force you're going to hear about in my next step. This is the last one you're going to learn about in order for you to be a master at kickball. So let's start. So let's just say the bases are loaded and the ball is kicked in the air. Try to catch it. When you do, some runner on the base could not be paying attention, so look around you for any more possible plays you can make. If I drop the ball, oh no, chase it down and do the same. Look around you for any more possible plays you can make. So let's just say, the ball is kicked in the air. The bases are still loaded. Let's just say the ball is kicked in the air. I look around myself and I have four options since um, the bases are loaded. I can step on hold. First, second, and third. This is called a force out. It's the chance to step on a base instead of tagging someone out or catching the ball. So now, here you have it. You now know how to play kickball. We went over fielding, kicking, pitching, and base running. I promise these steps will make you a superstar. Also, let's give a hand to my um, brother David who also helped out in the video. Hello. Thanks for watching. I'm sure you'll be a superstar at kickball.